Let's stay with a look at how much you can enjoy physics. Good morning, Clayton. Good morning, Kim and Copa. Yes, maybe in class when you're reading through those thick books of physics, you're thinking this does not look fun at all. But once you see it and touch it, you can see how exciting it can be. And we're at Fresno State with some of their physics department members learning how fun physics can be. And these guys get to travel around to schools. Uh, Brian, you go and visit with kids and you yeah. know, show them these fun things, right? All the time. It's, it's really awesome to see the lights turn on and see them get really excited about it. Very cool. So you're going to turn my lights on right now and show us some fun. So why do you have two plungers? This is two plungers. We're going to show a little bit demonstration about uh, atmospheric pressure. Uh, this works similar to a suction cup. Uh, inside here, we've pushed all the air out, so it makes it really low pressure inside. And the high pressure outside allows them to stay together. And I can do this. I'll show Simon on a chair. I just pull him in the chair and with his plungers. Together. But if he stands up and we pull him apart, it takes a little bit of force, but it pulls him apart to return the air pressure to normal inside so it's equalized outside. We also do a different uh, presentation with a bed of nails to show pressure as well. All right, Simon, what do we have a bed of nails for? Okay, so we're gonna continue with pressure and the kids love this one. Every time we bring this into the classroom, you know, they just light up, they're thinking, wow, I wanna lay on that bed of nails. And we like to explain pressure with this. So, I have this apple here and I'm gonna demonstrate. So this apple, depending on high, how high I drop it, it's gonna have a pretty big force. So I drop it, it gets stuck on that. So those are real nails. nails. Those are real nails. And you can see that area in which it fell was very small. So it's stuck on there and it's really oh, stuck on there. That, you can see the juice fall out. So I'm gonna lie and lay down on this, okay? Right. This is very low in here. There we go. Sit on it. You can see my area is rather large. As I lie down on it, my area goes up. I keep my force low and my pressure is low as well. And you're you're fine, you're not I'm bleeding fine. or anything. No, I'm not bleeding. So we're going to demonstrate a little bit more using you here. Great. Yes. What do I get to do? You're going to get to stand on me. Perfect. All right. So, uh, Brian, why do we have a big board there? Well, this just shows that we're going to add more weight, more force on there, but the area is distributed. So your, your weight is going to be distributed across this board, across his belly. So it really doesn't add that much more force to it, and the pressure doesn't change too much, and it won't So won't stand on him. him. Just go ahead and stand on him. All right, I'm going to use you just you in case. It, you got it. Is this good? Yep. Good. You're good. Just watch your balance on there. You're fine. Yeah. You're good. I can feel your weight, though. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> All right, so I see a bed of nails. I on him. He's laying on it, and he's totally fine. Yes. Very cool. So if you guys want the, if you want them to come to your class, your kids' class, you can call 278-6652, and they'll come do this whole demonstration, make ice cream and all sorts of fun stuff involving physics, so you can learn more, Kim and Kofi. You know, it's almost worth going back to school for that stuff. I'd say. Yeah, that was awesome. You know what? When you learn it like that, you yeah. know, I was always scared about anything that required math yeah. and learning. But my physics teacher in college was so fun yeah. that it wasn't scary. You know, Elaine had the same situation. She went back to school after we moved back from L.A. And she had to take physics, you know. And she got her credential and everything. And her, and she says, oh, my God, physics. Oh, what am I going to do? She had one of the greatest instructors. It made it so much fun. Yeah. And she learned a lot. And it wasn't painful, you right. know. Because a lot of times, well, like people like me, it was like pulling teeth. It can you be know? so boring. Yeah. yeah. Uh, or just <laughs> sometimes it doesn't sink in. Oh. But but she was, she loved the teacher, the presentation made it so much fun. She looked forward to going to class. Well, it's great to see all these students yeah. so enthused about it, too. Yeah, and hopefully they become teachers and go out there and oh, teach the kids. That would be great. Yeah. It's